this is mercy oh from Kano. good morning sir and my bless god for the anointing upon you both i had also was passing through the pains until the first of may service a testimony of the same was read i placed my hand on the what on the television on the tv as the senior pastor prayed claim my healing until eternity the affliction is gone Hallelujah. praise god god bless you and the family amen. amen and also i pray for everyone with any such affliction where you are it is over forever amen. in jesus name Hallelujah. testimony itohan from abuja good day sir and beautiful ma all right ma is beautiful sir is normal <laughs> Handsome, sir. <laughs> it's all right it's all right i'm okay I want to testify on the 17th of April 2020 my left eye suddenly started paining me it became red and swollen with water coming out of it I lost my sight in that eye almost completely that devil is a liar Amen. during the home cell you mentioned my case exactly and I was healed I've come to return all the glory to Jesus thank you for being a vessel sir thank you for being a blessing to this generation Hallelujah. God bless you Amen. It's a hand your eye remain open everyone Amen. with any form of eye affliction anywhere you are yes. the same testimony shall be yours Amen. in jesus name Amen. Amen. testimony on this closed name says good afternoon sir Ma. on friday the senior pastor declared that someone had pain on the right shoulder and hand the pain has disappeared at that moment the pain left me forever glory be to god thank you for being a blessing to our generation sir Ma. god bless you hallelujah at that same instant, someone with the right hip condition, upper, upper hip on the right hand towards the back, God is healing you right now. Amen. And every other related pain on the neck, left of the neck, God is healing you right now. Amen. And you are whole in Jesus' Amen. name. Hallelujah. A testimony from Sister Chinyere from Portacot says, Good morning, Sanma. On Thursday, I got a message from a family friend who was hospitalized for fever, cough, cold, catarrh, and pains. He said he couldn't even stand as he was texting me all the way from Lagos State where he was working as a naval officer. I told him to tune to Dunamis TV. My sister asked me to text the Dunamis prayer line, which I did and got a reply, divine intervention, and I said amen. To the glory of God, he was healed and discharged the same day. Next day. Oh, the next day. Right. Amazing. I've come to return all the glory to God. Thank you, sir and ma, for being there for our work. To God be all the praise in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are watching and there is any affliction that is similar to what you have heard, you are healed Amen. in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Testimony on this close them. Good day, sir and ma. I sent a message to our senior pastor on Sunday to pray for me because my menstrual flow hasn't been regular and I was one diagnosed of PCOS, that's polycystic ovarian syndrome. As a matter of fact, since January, I haven't seen my menses. But as I sent the message, the senior pastor replied, divine intervention in Jesus' name, I received it with faith. The same day, the menses did flow. Hallelujah. I just want to say, thank God. May God keep him blessing you. Amen. Amen. Whatever the devil has seized or arrested in your life, today, I declare it is restored. Hallelujah. And it is returned. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. Fruit of the womb is released for those trusting for the fruit of the womb. Marital settlement is released for those trusting for marital settlement. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Testimony of an undisclosed name. Good morning, sir. And I sent you a text about my health that, was, that I was having pains around my chest and also cough and headache. You replied divine intervention. Now, I'm totally okay. Hallelujah. I give God all the glory. God bless you, sir and ma, for the good work you are doing in God's house. To him alone be the glory. Amen. In every affliction, anyone is suffering is over forever Amen. in Jesus' name. Undisclosed name from Yola says, Good morning, Sama. I want to thank God for his mercy and healing power in the life of our daughter. I sent you a text message concerning her waking up with a swollen face and he declared divine intervention in Jesus' name. I answered amen and amen. That same day, the swelling started to deflate. It started deflating. On Wednesday after the declaration by the senior pastor on the communion of escape and oil of preservation, she drank of the communion and applied the oil on her face and to the glory of God, the swelling just dried up to its roots before Thursday morning. The next day, no medication was given to her. God be praised forever. Thank you, son, Ma, for always standing in the gap for us. God bless you and your family in Jesus' name. Amen. We pray for everyone with such a situation. Yes. They are arrested in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. 
Rufus from Mararaba says, good evening, sir. It's working. You know, my wife was pregnant for more than, mm, more than 41 more weeks. weeks with no sign of labor. But the moment you replied my text with divine intervention, the labor kick started. I gave her communion and anointed her stomach. To God be the glory, she delivered like a Hebrew woman, a bouncing baby girl. And, <laughs> and Becky is her and name. And Becky is her name. Ma, permission requested for the name. Why no, not? Permis permission <laughs> fully granted. Since. since. Why not? <laughs> since. Congratulations. Hallelujah. Congratulations. Mother and baby blessed, and alive baby blessed, and well in Jesus' and, name. And, and, and parents are all blessed. God bless you. Please, um, it is important that you include it. We have the numbers that send the, num the, 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 the testimonies. We have the numbers, but we didn't, we don't, we don't include the numbers for just the sensitivity of the privacy of the details. Okay, wouldn't do that. But if at least the initials or the names can be on the testimonies. When the testimony is very sensitive, we don't read the name. We initialize them. So just make sure it is done so that it can be a bit, I mean, appear authentic to many people in case some think that the undisclosed name means it's not a real testimony. Okay, please ensure that if, um, even if you don't want your name called, you can still send with the name and say, please, I want the privacy of the name. It will be, it will be honored and it can be, the initials can be respected. God bless you as you do so. And if you have your own testimonies, drastic testimonies, God has done COVID related testimonies and any such testimonies, let us have them and, 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 and we will let the people know what God is doing. The testimony lines are on. The essence of the message tonight is keep on holding on. Keep holding on. Keep holding on. At the place of prayer, go ahead and keep holding on. The, 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 the track is still online. Uh, uh, kindly watch, like, share the link, subscribe to the video, comment on it, and let your friends know. You, you, you have sent the links to people before, but let's send it again and again. Keep holding on. We are in a season where depression is, is just, is just I've received so many text messages of depression. People contemplate no manner of things, but God is on the throne. Send it out and the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Tomorrow is another day. It's going to be very blissful. I told you since Sunday about tomorrow. And I trust God that God will give us a word that will move us and usher us to the next level. Amen. Keep holding on. We are around the corner yes. already. The bend of the road is not the end of the road. Beyond the road, the bend, Beyond the road continues. And that is where we are right now. God is on the throne and victory is assured in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. You have a wonderful day. And we're looking forward to hearing your testimonies related to today's date, this time and season. You know God is a God of times and seasons. Mm -hmm. And I believe that God has issued out, released out some amazing testimonies today. 36 years 34. 34 years 34. ago, God did an amazing work in my life. A divine encounter. I was on my own overnight. I had an encounter that lasted about two to, two, two to four hours. And that encounter drastically changed my life. Changed the course of my destiny. I was hearing communication and I was responding. And it changed the course of my life. I prophesy on this same day, may God give you an encounter on your life's journey, your spiritual journey. Amen. May he give you a testimony. Amen. May he do something new in your life that Amen. will release you to that next level Amen. spiritually, Amen. that will give you that next mantle you desire, Amen. that will give you that next experience you desire, Amen. that will usher everything about you and break every iniquitous bondage on your, in your life Amen. in the name of Jesus Christ Amen. and give you long desired answers Amen. to questions in your heart. Amen. God bless you. We love you. Amen.